Greetings, Libra. Welcome to your horoscope. So Sagittarius time for Libra is about your local environment, siblings, particularly younger siblings, maybe cousins, close friends, people you grew up with or at least have known since college age. And it's about discovering what you're passionate about, about working with your hands. A lot of Libra people are crafty. One of my favorite little crafts was the potato prints. When I was a kid, they take tempera paint and uh, have a potato, you know, cut up like it was a flower or a snowflake or something and use that on construction paper and make holiday greeting cards. And um, I think you're very capable of that type of thing. Poetry, songwriting, any way you communicate is much more emphasized now as the third house is activated. Now, all right, the real deal. Four luminaries in Scorpio, North Node, Mercury, Venus, um, Saturn. Money issues are huge for Libra right now. And so you're going to have to work on it. And you might be cashing in. I mean, you might have a real flow. But there's also this feeling like there's never quite enough. So what you have to do is be grateful for what you have. First of all, wealth is an attitude more than an actual commodity. I've seen some of the most spoiled rich kids and some of the most fun-loving poor children in a dump heap. So I know that our attitudes are really what makes us magic and transparent, not necessarily our resources. In fact, sometimes when you have too many resources, you can't see the forest for the trees. So what I would say for you, Libra, is, you know, this weekend, you might have a lot of career stuff. You might be having to work extra for some other people. So you're kind of entertaining on the spot. It's understandable. And um, you just need a little boost of, of confidence this week. You know, partnership-wise, things seem like they're kind of shaky and crazy. In fact, your whole social life is just a little bit weird right now. <laughs> yeah, I, I think that would be okay to say. Um, but the good part is, is that you have values and you're dealing with them right now. And um, I think there is like a past place in one of your spiritual, one of your past lives or in your subconscious, there's this right thing to do. You've got to choose that this week. 